All right, Dean, I want you to watch how your body moves a split second before your arms move. You want to bring everything to the party at the same time. So like I, like I told Greg, that elbow has to initiate the movement. I don't want you to move and then swing that elbow, okay? So maybe think about um, in your stance, tucking that elbow, talking about your off arm, tucking that elbow, tucking, or tucking the entire arm in a little bit tighter uh, so you don't have to reach and then throw it. You want to throw right off the bat. Okay, stay as low as you can. You do a pretty good job on your first turn, taking a long explosive step, long explosive step, then a quick gather step, gather step, keep your feet underneath you, touch the line, and explode out of there. On your 10, uh, your 10 yard dash, remember man, you really wanna think about getting that full extension of the trail leg, so make sure you're doing those stretches. Uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna do some exercises all week uh, to kind of help uh, kind of help get you opened up a little bit, get you extending the legs a little bit better. Uh, get a little bit more of a lean while you're in your stance. Like the, at, I'm talking about the clip that I'm just looking at. Uh, you can lean up. Maybe uh, you can at least you can maybe get a little bit more weight uh, to your right before you take off so you don't have to rock into it. Okay? Make sure uh, when you're in your stance, and when, I'm, when you're going to the right, your right foot is kind of offset a little bit to keep, to keep that hip opened up. So you can step across easier. And remember, also when you're when you're at the lines, when you're touching the lines, the inside foot needs to either be parallel to the outside foot or slightly behind the outside foot. Uh, if not, that's gonna kind of make you step forward uh, and, instead of running straight down the line, uh, like you you'll see yourself do in some of the clips. Like you actually just did a good job of it right there. Uh, but on one but on one of the clips, you start on the green when you touch the line. And then you end up stepping on the white because the hips are closed. Also, remember, it's not enough to just throw that elbow when you're in your stance. When you're running, when you're running that 10 in between the turns, throw those elbows forward and back. Swing them in the shoulders. Get as much power out, put out of those arms as you can. On this rep, you did a better job of throwing the, throwing the elbow, but the hand that's on the ground, you kind of just pick it up and you leave it, you leave it kind of idle for a split second before you swing it. Swing both arms simultaneously. Swing those arms hard, and you want to swing them fast. Like right when, right when you start, your arms got to start with you. The arms got to start swinging. Also, remember on your second turns, make sure you make sure you don't gather or throttle down uh, too early. You'll get yourself overextended. And that outside foot's gonna end up sliding out from underneath you.